First of all, let me apologize because I already looked in the new packs and when I did, I got these. So first of all is Cthun. Cthun's least favorite Hearthstone card, Eye for an Eye. Yeah, I, I get that. Because Eye for an Eye deals damage exactly uh, how much is dealt to the other hero. Uh, yeah, this is the pinnacle of the old gods. Yeah, it's a really, really dangerous 10 mana card. Which gets all kinds of boosts from things like Pekanor of Evil. Which gives you a Cthulhu plus 2 plus 2 wherever it is, even if it's inside the deck. <laughs> you evil, come on boy. Nice. Uh, yeah, so they got two of those and one Cthulhu. Let's see what else is happening. And my 69 decks. First, let's get the classic pack that we got from the Tavern Ball and see what's in that. Got one there. Nothing too special about here. I think I already have all of those. Okay. Isn't there some shortcut to, to do this? Fine. Nasty sound. I love it. One rare Darkshire Librarian. Which is nice if you can ignore the battle cry somehow by putting it last. Cthulhu's Chosen, I've seen that a lot going around. Yeah, I like this one, it's 2-2 uh, two, two for 2 and plus a knock explosion, I think it's nice. Also like this one. It's like Mark of the Wild, but no taunt. Yeah, this is a very special nasty one. Probably gonna see a lot of play. Just one rare, Kluxi Ember Weaver. Hmm, it's a nice one. Yeah, I've seen a lot of these guys. Shadow makes face mages very good. I already played Shadow Strike and Tavern Ball. It's a very nice immediate damage. It's like a very powerful backstab. Rare, another shatter. Abram Berserker, that's kind of a weak card, I think. Though with 5 health, he's probably going to survive the first hit. Which makes it likely it'll do more damage. Spell damage plus 2 is nice, but 2 2 for 4 isn't. This could be very dangerous. And Ravaging Ghoul is probably going to see a lot of play. I've already seen it. Okay, Dragon's Grotesque Dragonhawk is Moon Fury 5 5, which is a nice Dragonhawk, but it's 7. It's a slightly upgraded version of Moon Fury Harpy, which is probably not very good. So, if we want stealth, is a nice, nice, nice organ. Probably gonna be good with the aggressive decks. And the faceless 7 7 4 4. It's very, very nice. <laughs> That's cute, just as cute. Not sure how playable it is. Next one. Man. Not getting a lot of value out of these decks so far. Yeah, I've already seen Darkshire Councilman. This could be useful. On the hand is a very nice card. I've already got three shadows. Um, I mean, I've seen critics of this card. And. 2243 is not very powerful, but if you f do fill the board and you play it late, it could be useful and not totally against it. And this is very nice for a Murloc deck, though quite costly for 2 3. Yeah. Epic! Renounced Darkness, yeah, it's a very nice one. Probably gonna run it in any Warlock deck I build. Scorn Tentacle is, uh, is nice for 3. Blood Hoof Brave, 2 6 taunt. Mm. Yeah, it could be useful. It could probably survive the first hit. Taunt. Uh, it's probably gonna take 2 or 3 before it scores down, so it's a nice stalling technique. Okay, 
Okay, on graph 3 to 5, nice little beast, adult grizzly. This could be a nice replacement or addition to the knife juggler in different decks, if you're running those kinds of decks. First mate, <laughs> that was the Hokia, yeah, it's not a very powerful weapon, but it's 1-1, one, one. it's a very good start for a warrior. Probably gonna get rid of those dragon hawks. Epic! Crazed Worshipper. Oh yes, I've seen this one. Yeah, it's probably gonna take at least two hits before it goes down, so it's a nice way to give yourself defense and buff your cartoon. This is a nice clear board for for one. It's an all all minions, yeah, that's the problem. Yeah, seven six for six, it's a nice card. Dusk ball. Don't play against mage decks. Otherwise, not bad. Faceless Behemoth, yeah, good luck bringing that in. But it's nice. Faceless Summoner, yeah, I think I'm gonna like this one. 5 5 6 is not bad with a random 3 cost minion. Probably gonna run that a lot if I'm not playing aggressive decks. Blackwater Pirate for Warrior decks, maybe. Another scrum into the call. Yeah, I've seen the Possessed Villager. It's also cool. Golden Bear, Spreading Madness. I'm probably gonna sell that. But I don't, don't really keep golden cards, and this is a very dangerous card. That's the first Dragon Hawk. Oh, Psychotron. I like the new Psychotron. It's quite expensive, but 3 for, f three, four for 5 could be useful. Firebat, also a good addition to Hunter Aggressive decks. It's not bad for what you get for it. Uh, yeah, fill the board up with tentacles. Not bad for a Warlock if you can do that. I've seen, I've seen it done with the uh, the tentacle that gives you plus one plus one for all uh, for every minion. Very useful. Man. Another behemoth. Give me a plus one plus for each of your totems. This is not gonna. I don't think it's very playable. I mean, even with a shaman deck that you aim for totems, you usually get two or three on the board at any one time. Not sure it's very useful. For Lone Stalker, give all Death Rattle minions in your hand, plus one, plus one. If you play Death Rattle Hunter, which is what Hunters usually do, it's, but still kind of very specific. And 4, 2, 4, 3, eh, it's okay card. Blade of Cultus with a combo, you get a 2, 3, 4, 1, which is very nice for not so early roleplay. Probably gonna use that. Oh, legendaries. Blood Sail Cultist for Warrior Pirate decks. Probably not going to play that a lot. Man. Two whales. Yeah, I've seen that played a lot. Probably going to use that too. Not very good against mage decks, but for two damage and plus two plus two for turn, and it takes one hit. Yeah, I've also seen that play. It's very nasty for a late warrior play. It's very annoying. Probably gonna use that. Golden Common. Yeah. Maybe. I'll probably sell that if I get another one. Twilight Geomancer. Yeah, I really like this one. Give your cartoon taunt. If you can buff it up really well. Epic, uh, epic and uh, Excuse me for a minute. I need to keep it down a bit. Okay. Uh, yes. I see Squid's face. Give you a plus two attack. Mm, it's 4 4 4 4. 
Actually, for us, that's one of the best four jobs I've seen. Now with the recent notes. Called Apothecary, fortune enemy and restored restore to health to your hero. 445 is not very good, and when you get to that point that you need it, it's probably not going to do you a lot of good. Yeah, I'm probably going to sell that. Now, Valve and Inquisitor is something I really like, because if you play a Paladin Murloc, which is a very good Paladin build, this, this makes it so much more powerful, and it costs one. You can start churning out Murlocs, and the Murloc and the, the Murloc recruit is really cute. Legendary! Oh yes, I love this one. With the brand I've seen it used, it's very nasty. Yeah, probably gonna sell the Golden Blood of Brave. Yeah, also very good if you use a Murloc Paladin. Nothing new here, nothing new here. Feral Rage. I guess that if you need it, but I usually play aggressive decks and I'm not sure it's really useful on aggressive decks. Bog Creeper 6847, Taunt is pretty good. Just 50 more. of souls. If you can get your Castina, which is probably what a lot of people are going to try to do. I don't think it's probably going to be too late for that. Shadow World Horror. It's going to be nasty on priests. Shadow World Horror will probably kill aggressive decks. And that, and that, and that, and that, and that, yeah, I've seen all of those. 1-5 mm, for 3 is not very good, I think. 1 is just too little damage. I'd happily take a 2-4. All the rest we've seen, that's too many Dragonhawks. Epic! Forbidden Flame. Yes, I'm gonna use that on mages a lot. Standing against Darkness. 5 1 1 recruits. Which is probably the, uh, to replace most of a battle. And. Actually, it's not bad if you. If you plan for flooding the board with Knife Juggler and stuff like that. Not bad. We're gonna let get a lot of dust from all this. Epic. Not sure I like the new polluted holder. Four, I think it's too much. It's only gonna get killed soon, oh, very fast. Forbidden ancient spend all your mana, gain plus one plus one for each mana spent. This is gonna be very nice. If played in late game, yeah. Very tough to remove. Game plus attack for each other card in your hand. Midnight. Ooh, that's nice. Well, probably it's gonna be 5 4 or 4 maybe 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 6 4. Still nice. 4. A minimum of 4 4 4 4. Very good. Man. Yes, I've already seen the Rubin Prophet in Paul. It's very nice, especially if you get it early. Cult Sorcerer. Yes, for Cthulhu Mage Dex, this is gonna be the card to play. Mm, nice little buff for the Paladin. Maybe even too little. Makes me think of magic buffs. Magic. Mm, Master Evolution. I like the new evolution thing for Shaman. It's gonna be very fun, especially for gimmicky decks. Uh, yeah. Yeah, use this and flood the board with tentacles. Lovely. 
Uh, ooh, that's a nice game for control, please. Let uh, mess the opening mix. Shadow Caster. Oh, I love this one. Imagine a 1 1 kill to Zardo. Anything else with a very nice effect. Like Master Evolution, for example. Zalos Initiate. Mm. Yeah, for quick play, it could be nice. Another stand against the darkness. Twilight Darkman though. Yeah, I haven't seen this one played, but getting to 10, 10 attack with Cthulhu is not very difficult. All the rest we've seen. Oh, tentacles. I think it's really cute. But five. I think it's gonna be hard to justify. This is. I think this is kind of excellent, actually. Any minion with a plus one plus one, chosen carefully, could be very good. Infested town. Yeah, it's like uh, James from Mexico had said. I don't think it's very good. Two, three, four, four. Even with taunt, it's kind of weak. And two, two. It's coming into late. Too much spreading madness. Too many trailer hawks. Discover the other Yeah. It would be nice though. I'd appreciate it if it was part of a minion. Seen that, seen that, seen that, seen that, seen that. Golden layer. Ooh, pretty. Oh, again, I'll sell it if I get another common, another regular. Yeah, let's just see. Embrace the shadow. Can infest still damage instead. Not sure exactly how useful it is, but for one turn, I mean, usually the the what's his name, the the soul priest or whatever, it makes you deal damage instead. It's usually too much for me. One turn it could be nice. Infested wolf. This could be very dangerous. I think three three four four is not bad, and when it dies. To one spiders. That's probably not web slingers, so. But could still be very annoying. <coughs> Some of them I've seen, seen that. Regular Evolve. This could be very useful actually. Is that an epic? Oh, just my imagination. Uh, we've seen that, we've seen that, we've seen most of this, yeah, the Twilight Elder is very good. 3443, so even without this, is a pretty good card. Probably why I've seen it, it can be played a lot. Deal 4 damage to a minion. Apparently I'm still being too loud. Okay. Into the slime is nice. Yeah. Seen all of those. Demented frost color. Not sure how useful that is, but I think I'll have to check because it seems like fun. And yeah, freeze mage. <laughs> Deathwing. 
Oh yeah, Deathwing. Hold on to my head. Not sure how useful that is. Because if we get to Deathwing, then probably a lot of dragons have already been played. Adding blade. Plus one, plus one, team of the divine shield. Uh, that's a paladin card. I guess you can get enough divine shield minions to do this. But I kind of highly doubt that. Spreading Madness, another one of those. Servant of Yogg-Sawon. Cast on the spell, it costs 5 or less. I'm not really sure how this is useful except in game attacks. Stormcrack thing seems weird. Hmm, now I have to regular Stormcrack. I'm thinking of selling the golden one. It's so beautiful. Rare. Already seen all of those. Don't get a lot of dust. This could be useful actually. We could probably get it down to three, maybe even two. Could be very good. Thunder City Huckster. Another random class card to your hand. Two two for two is not bad. But the cloud might be a bit late. Be very cool, but at eight, it's kind of expensive. I don't see the usual one, just costs three. Hmm. I think I'd prefer a way to choose. Dr. Alchemist. That's nice. Four, five, four, five with a heal effect. Yeah, yeah, I think it's useful. Hmm, yeah, see what it is. I've already seen all of those. Too far rages. Cyclopean Hall. Uh, hmm, with Taunt. With Taunt is a nice way to give a defensive turn. I like it. Epic. Dark Speaker. Swap stats with a friendly minion. Yeah, if you need to buff up a good. Good family that that was taken down. Very useful. Should have had a class tentacle. Yeah, class tentacle. Ancient harbinger, which is a way to get your Cthulhu out of your deck. If you only have one or two ten cost things. I don't agree that this is completely useless, but 
You have to be very controlling with this thing. Yuxalm, Yuxalm is fun. Seen that, seen all of that. Gone well, Darkshire Labyrinth. Yeah, seen that. Mm, it's very simplistic. Too good in stone crack. It's very pretty. Toilet summoner. A one one four four with a face the five five death rattle. I'm not sure about this one. Yeah, one 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 for four. It's not gonna give enough punch. Not the dark fisher, really. Net. I think this is stupid. I don't like it at all. Johnny Blow. Fuck you, Net. This is the That's actually kind of cool. Yeah, seen the rest. Yeah, yeah. Epic Shadowcaster. Yeah. Way too many dragon hooks. Too many dragon hooks. Three of those. Nice. But I think I already have a few of those. Yeah, I've seen all of those. Just two more. Yeah, I definitely have something to sell. Way too many dragon hawks. Give me a legendary one as well. Yeah, I've seen all of those. Let's look at the tally. Six trade cards. Four of those. Five of those. There you go. You think it was apparent from the local tavern after tucking Dr. Boom up its sleeve? Charge had three sons, Mark, Theodore, and Chris. <laughs> Do you spend too long in perform a more susceptible to the whispers of the old gods? Right now they are whispering the lyrics to La Bamba. Let's be honest, one option is a lot ragier than the other. Yep. Yeah. Not sure which is better. I like Mock of the Wild. Amber Weaving is a specialty course at the local trade school. Hey, is that my own for sale? No, I'm keeping it. <laughs> and six of those. There's a whole gradient of our color. This one is on the darker side. If I bet, 
You'll always be our first. Seven. The most difficult girls if you don't hit any ducks. Carry on my wayward grub. <laughs> Good. He's going to leave the dying up to you, if that's cool. A little flea powder will fix that right up. Hello, Michel, Leo, and Hafer aren't here right now, but if you leave a message, we'll get back to you right away. We <laughs> make the call next time. Only one. Hmm. This flame is not to be used unless you are licensed acolyte of the old gods. No matter how many times we tell her not to, she keeps feeding the thin scraps under the table. What's cooler than being cool? Make sure you summon a toilet marshmallow color too. Mm. He prefers that you prefer refer to him by his nickname, Frost Waker. Right. Right. Wow, right. Put this one down in the flame waker. Nasty combination. Yuxon always likes to complain about how he has too many servants and there are too many mouths to feed. Because the beast of a thousand mouths. They never get the recognition they deserve. Yeah, they're the faceless. Yeah, got some of that from the classic. Yeah. Divine Strength. Every year a few paladins get disqualified from Westfall Weightlifting Championship for using Divine Strength. <sighs> Selfless hero, don't worry about me, I'll just be here under these tentacles. Nobody expects the Valfin Inquisition. <laughs> <coughs> light in the darkness. Wait, how can you have light in the dark? If you turn on the light, well, it doesn't that mean it's no longer back? There's a point though. As far as blades go, this one is really great in the motivation department. Turns out divine shields are way cheaper if you buy in bulk. Yeah. So if you're too tired, you can just kind of lean against the darkness. <laughs> When your Akani so priest is calling sick. Yes. That guy. Wait, what kind of acolyte doesn't wear a hood? <laughs> yeah, it's kind of standard for acolytes. It's more succinct than Shadow World's Suck into Vortex. <laughs> the second ingredient liquefied funnel cake. Mm, not really a funny, funny kind of guy. Because you're wrapped in a protective layer of tentacles. First, she separates them from the lights, washes them in cold water, and hang dries. He has a poor understanding of the law of diminishing returns. Not sure I get that one. Don't stop believing there's something below. I don't get that one either. Psst, you wanna buy a random class card from your opponent's class? Yes, please. It's like a backstab only from the front and with two more stabs. <laughs> Quick, before I drown, let me sharpen your sword for you. <laughs> exactly. Shadowcaster. I mean, it's not creepy if you ask before you steal their shadow to make a small replica of them to keep on your shelf. Evolve. So you say you want an evolution. Well, you know, we all want to change the board. 
Gulch, Gulch and the banner of a new line of Earth totems available at vendors everywhere this holiday season. Uh, yeah, two of these stone cracks and two of these stone cracks. Warning, do not touch the purple ball of lightning. Yeah, you shouldn't. The art is pretty, but I'm gonna sell these. Need the dust. He's on fire, boom shakalaka. <laughs> It'll be really useful in the new Hearthstone game. Don't go there. Just can't resist the opportunity to hang around with a bunch of totems. Lots of warlock cards. Actually, Kazan gives his full support for this ritual. like a piñata, a lame, disgusting, horrific piñata. Do not be late with your overdue finds. See you, darkness. Democracy in action. Most citizens of Darkshire wear these surgical masks to prevent spreading madness to tourists. Definitely gonna sell that. This thing burdens your soul like a good ushing. <laughs> Hates when the Zoss yells, Ahoy matey, but there's not really much you can do about it. They're really just in it for the blood blood bat. Ten of those but goes by ravishing ghoul when he hits the club. Funny. He thought the set was called with flippers of the old of the old cards and hungrily volunteered to be in it. He's definitely going to get his hearing checked. That was kinda stupid. Back in the day, each shield weighed two tons and she had to carry four of them on each arm. Wait, what did I miss? Oh, that one. 39! Tentacle. Because every day in the day of the tentacle. Because every day is the day of the tentacle of Nazoth. Like the reference. Okay, initiate, you need to settle down and do your job. In this case, that means die so someone else can get a minor buff. Bile actually makes for surprisingly sturdy fins. <laughs> Didn't know that. Often excluded from dinner parties, to be fair, he's very boring. Fucking net. You can take away his humanity, but you will all never take away his fishing pole. Fucking pickle. Okay, Katsunan, repeat after me. Your mother was a hamster. <laughs> and your father smelled of elderberries. Sometimes the old guards' corruption gives you power until sometimes you get a plus one attack. We can't only win those in the Eldritch Lottery. Power creep. Oh, I get it. Magma Rager. Not sure it's a good swap. No. Cthulhu's Cthulhu recruiting pitch involves cookies, which is why it's the most popular old god. Who's the cutest little lizard? You are. Yes, you are. Yes, you're the cutest little lizard in the whole world. Yes, he's very cute. Yeah, I think we can agree that killing the squirming tentacles first is a good idea. Yes. Just doesn't understand those Twilight youngsters anymore with their comic books and their rock music. <laughs> 
Ai văzut că de fără e Look, they fell off the back of a ship. Do you want them or not? I have a meeting with the charge in like 10 minutes. He gave her a promise ring and everything. What are the qualifications for being a horror? Just how horrible do you have to be? Not very horrible, I guess. You know the tentacle. Right, it's the replacement for the Geoman, so... Yeah, I'll take spell damage plus two and mages and stuff. The overall mind of the old gods are surprisingly similar. <laughs> they are, don't they? Aren't they? Still feel some in the daytime. Yeah. We're all greed or this could happen to you. If you strike him down, he'll become more powerful than you can possibly imagine. Yeah. Every month they share a pancake breakfast with the perfectly rational worshippers. <laughs> Cults need pharmacists too, you know. People often think that Dark Speaker is the arch nemesis of Light Speaker, but that title actually belongs to Heavy Speaker. Annoying Grotron was just too unwieldy and accurate. <laughs> yeah, much more annoying. Why do I still have this? Should probably sell that too. Ancient Harbinger, honey, can you run down to the store and pick up some 10 cost minions? Thanks. For CEOs, it's very handy to have your crystal ball hanging right in front of your face. self-reducing prophecy. <laughs> Just before it comes into play, there is an awesome training montage with Cthulhu. <laughs> He's tried other things, but bog seedling, bog ambling, and bog trundling just aren't as effective as bog creeping. Way too many dragon hawks. They say that grotesque is in the eye of the beholder, but that's just because they never seen the grotesque Stegomark. Yikes. Hello, Twin Emperor. <coughs> Did you make decisions based on age? I'm two minutes older, therefore we burn this village. And the Chow often wonders what path his life might have taken if he wasn't named, you know, El the Chow. Deathwing! To his credit, Deathwing really looked the heart. Really took the heart, the feedback he was receiving, that he needed to be more of a team player. <laughs> and Behemoth. Projected names 40 foot faceless, big old no face, huge creature sans face, Teddy. Okay, let's see. 1355 dust. Yes, please. One epic. One epic. 26 hours. Give me a minute. What epic? So what did I miss over here? Yeah, so I cover that one. Okay. Lots and lots of dust. And I'll start crafting decks later ish. Yeah, I do not get the Cthulhu. Yeah, all of these decks I've earned. No eyes of Cthulhu for me. Yeah, 
and I'm guessing I'm done for now. Bye bye.